Hi there, in this video, I'm gonna show you how to transcribe your online uh, meetings uh, using Microsoft Teams and Microsoft uh, Stream. So when you record a, a Microsoft Teams meeting, the video recorded uh, is, is automatically saved into your Microsoft Stream account under your name. So here is a, a meeting that we just completed and uh, as you can see, I got a notification saying that the meeting has been uh, you know, stored. So all I have to do is just go into Microsoft Stream and under Microsoft Stream, you have uh, going to my content and there is actually a separate uh, section where all the, all your meetings get stored. So uh, who can start the recording? Uh, the person uh, who is part of the uh, the meeting participants and he's, he's part of your organization and they have, uh, you know, a valid Office 365 license uh, only those people can record a uh, started recording okay anyone outside your organizations they can't record and they can't have a, a their own version of your recording okay uh, keep that in mind but having said that i'll actually do a separate video in the coming days on how to do uh, this recording using the new microsoft uh, teams experience uh, but for now let's stay with the the older experience so here in meetings just click on meetings there and here you can actually see I have uh, uh, some recorded sessions here, right? So if I just go into this meeting, just open this up. Um, if a meeting has, uh, if the transcription has, has been finished on this video, you'll actually see a, a panel in here uh, called transcription, right? Uh, however, you, do, you don't see that here because by default, uh, the transcription is not enabled on, on the recorded videos. So what you have to do is you just have to go into, click on this three dots here and click update video details. Once you're in the, the update details pane, you have to do two things. One is make sure that the video language is, is set to English or whichever language uh, you, you is, is spoken on the videos. Uh, so uh, by default, you don't see that setup, uh, but in this video, in this case, uh, because I was testing in order to prepare for this uh, recording, I already had this video language set to English. So just make sure that the video language is, is set to English and then you actually turn on captions. Okay, so these are the two main things that you need to uh, make sure that they are enabled. Once you have that, uh, you just come back in here and click apply. Now you actually see uh, there is a transcription uh, panel uh, available on your meeting uh, on, on the video page. It usually takes some time for the auto transcription to come through. Uh, so you just have to wait and, and come back and check. Uh, so uh, here is the one that I've actually had like, you know, a previous meeting that I was uh, had transcriptions enabled on it. And you can see once a transcription has been enabled, you can actually see uh, all like, you know, um, captions created for you based on the, the timestamps. So uh, it does 80 percent of the work for you in terms of, uh, you know, by you know capturing the spoken word uh, but you have to really go in and, and make some changes so in this case for example I wanted to go and say maybe Show I didn't say the word partial you know, um, thing. Uh, PowerPoint in there right so you what you would do is just go here and click on PowerPoint remove the word partial and click save uh, you can, and the thing is for example you know, also because... do uh, say um, can actually play the, the video stream. and that will automatically yeah. take you to the I'll actually show you the how location that of that video and it actually plays uh, the video in there. Uh, similarly, uh, you can also do in the transcription, you can just go and search for the word, let's say Microsoft and automatically picks picks up and it'll take you then, uh, to that timestamp. So if you just click on that, it'll it automatically it takes them. you to, to that location of, uh, of the video. Uh, that's how uh, you would transcribe your videos, right? In the next video, I would uh, I'll actually show you how to download the transcription um, once you've cleared uh, cleaned it up a bit. How to download that and actually put that back into your meeting minutes wherever you store that meeting minutes, uh, either on um, your uh, the wiki page, uh, the meeting minutes on the themes, or you would prefer to put it in a, a Word document or put it in an email and send it to somebody, whatever it is, uh, we'll actually show you, I'll actually show you how to grab this uh, transcription and then put it into a different uh, file. Uh, thanks for watching. This is Jag Kakarlapudi from uh, my um, a modern work group based in Melbourne, Australia. Thanks for watching. Cheers.